the wall, I'm out of facts and words. And here we have another story of government run amok. So, secret text and Senate bill would give FBI warrantless access to email records. You see, these people just absolutely demand to snoop in our business. Well, why do they do that? Well, they're a bunch of busybodies. They just want to invade our privacy all the time, it seems like. And... You need to be aware that this is going on. Uh, I don't know if I did this video or not, but, uh, about the cell towers, fake cell towers. Yeah, I did. The uh, stingrays. They can uh, search any phone anywhere in Rochester, New York, and I'm sure most other cities. They're basically snooping in your cell phone and see what's in there. It's a mass surveillance program, though they deny it. Anyway, this is a counterpart to that, which is going in your email and going to whatever uh, different carriers carrying websites and demanding all the information on the website of website owners, that type of thing. It's unclear how or when the provision was added, although Senators Richard Burr, Republican North Carolina, the ch committee's chairman Tom Cotton, Republican Arkansas, have both offered bills and passed. It would address what the FBI calls a gap, and privacy advocates consider a serious threat to civil liberties. So, you know, there you have supposedly conservative Tom Cotton selling its out. At this point, it should go without saying that information the FBI wants to include in the statute is extremely revealing. URLs, for instance may reveal the content of a website that users have visited, their location, and so on. Andrew Cracker, staff attorney for Electronic Frontier Foundation, wrote an email to the Intercept. Intercept's the uh, site that I'm on. And it's particularly sneaky because this bill is the bay behind closed doors. Robert Green, Policy Council at Open Technology Institute said in an interview. In February, FBI Director James Comey testified during Senate Intelligence Committee hearing on worldwide threats that the FBI's inability to get email records with NSLs was a typo, and that fixing it was one of the FBI's top legislative priorities. Green warned at the time, unless we push back against Comey now, before you know it, long slow push for an electronic communication transaction records fix may just be unstoppable. I'm going to break this down. I always get some liberal who turns around and says, well, I'm not doing anything wrong. Why do I care? Why should I care? It doesn't affect me. I mean, I didn't do anything wrong, so why should it bother me? Well, Mr. I don't care liberal, here's the problem. Here's why you should care is that they're breaking the law, that's why. The Supreme Law of the Land, the Constitution. They have to have a search warrant. That's why you should care. It's not what you have in your email or it's not what sites you visited or anything. That's not what matters. What matters is they're breaking the law. If they 
They try to go in your email without a warrant. They're breaking the law, and they deserve to be punished. It's as simple as that. And I would go further. Perhaps me, the law would go further, and they would be required not only to get a warrant. The other thing they would have to do is they would have to notify you in advance that they're going to search it. I don't care. You know, I'm all for limiting the authority of government because I know how bad government has gotten. You're uh, living in a very, very ugly situation in this country. Believe me. Oh, if the provision is added to the e ECPA, it'll kill the bill. Passes independently, it, it'll create a gaping loophole. Either way, there's a big problem, massive expansion of government surveillance authority. Yeah, I'd say there's a big problem. The big problem with government sticking its nose in where it doesn't belong. Like I said, this is similar to the cell phone thing where uh, Rochester and other cities are conducting mass surveillance, going in everybody's cell phone, seeing what they can find. This is a similar situation. Not that I really thought our stuff was private anyway. But these slime aren't going to stop. My God, can you imagine if Hitler had had these tools? We'd have never won the Second World War. Now the fascism is on our side. And we've got to stop these people. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.